So you might be in this crazy situation where for some reason your iPhone is just not connecting to your PC at all. Now, the very first thing I recommend doing is just making sure that your particular iPhone and your PC have a connection at all that they can actually go and connect with. If it's a wireless connection you're trying to go and connect them with, make sure your Bluetooth settings are on and all of them and make sure they're, and make sure they're even compatible with each other. But the most popular thing that a lot of people are going to use is some sort of USB Type-C cable or Lightning cable. The first thing I recommend doing is making sure that this particular cable that you're using is fully functional, it completely works, and there's nothing wrong with these particular cables. A lot of the times if you're going to go through and trying to connect your PC and your iPhone, using a cable is the best method and you want to make sure this cable is completely working and there's no issues with it. So go through, plug in one side of the particular cable to your particular iPhone, plug the other side to your PC, and you want to see if that ends up fixing the problem. If it doesn't fix it, go ahead and unconnect it, disconnect it, and try plugging the both sides back in again, and you want to see if that ends up fixing the problem as well. A lot of the times, all you're going to have to do is just plug in these particular devices together, and that could end up fixing the problem in and of itself. On top of that, on your PC, you want to make sure that you're going to the proper area in which your iPhone is supposed to be connected with. So if you're trying to go into the files application, or you're trying to go wherever, or iTunes, or whatever, you want to make sure, once again, that your iPhone is even compatible with your device, and if it's a Mac, it usually is. Now, if it's still not working, you may want to double check this cable and replace this cable and use a different one because if, you, if the cable is the problem, it's not going to you know, be able to be fixed. Another thing you're going to want to do is to try to go through and essentially update your particular iPhone. So what you can do here is you can go inside of your general settings here. You can go into software update, see if there's an update available for your iPhone, and you want to do the exact same thing on your Mac or your PC or whatever you have. Go inside of your particular PC, try software updating that particular PC as well, and that could very well end up fixing the problem. Finally, if none of those things are working, try restarting your particular iPhone or restarting your particular MacBook, and you want to see if those things end up fixing the problem as well. So that pretty much covers it up here for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.